Hey, this is Andrew Brown from ExamPro, and we're taking a look at a key value store. So a key value store or database is a type of non-relational database or NoSQL that uses a simple key value method to store data. And so key value stores are dumb and fast, uh, but they generally lack features like relationships, indexes, aggregation. Of course, there are going to be providers out there who have managed solutions that might uh, polyfill some of those uh, issues there. But I want to show you the underlying way that key value stores work to kind, to, uh, kind of distinguish them between document stores. So a key value stores literally a unique key alongside a value. And the reason I'm representing that as zeros and ones is because I want you to understand that that's what it is. It's basically just some kind of, of data there and how the key value uh, store interprets it is going to determine what it is. So when you look at a document database, that is just a key value store that uh, uh, interprets the value as being documents, right? And so key value stores can and do commonly store um, uh, multiple, uh, like an associated array, that's pretty common. So even for DynamoDB, that's how it does it. And so that's why when you look at a key value store, it looks like it uh, a, a table, but it's not actually a table. It's schema list because underneath, it's really just um, you know that associative array. And so that's why you can have uh, columns, or sorry, rows that have uh, different amounts of columns, okay? So due to the design, they're able to scale very well uh, beyond a relational database, and they can kind of work like a relational database without all the bells and whistles. So hopefully, you know, that makes sense, okay?